This video is sponsored by Keeper. iOS 17 has tons of new features that aren't always talked about, and so here's part two of our iOS 17 hidden features that you need to know. If you haven't seen part one, be sure to click the icon in the upper right corner. Inside of the Messages app, if you want to send a photo super quick, all you have to do is actually hold down the plus icon here, and it will take you straight to the Photos app for Messages. In the Mail app, if you want to make a text a hyperlink, there's a much easier way to do this. Just copy your link to your clipboard, highlight the word that you want to turn into a link, and then tap on the word to bring up those options here, and tap on Paste. This will then turn your word right into a hyperlink. Inside of the Photos app, go ahead and tap Edit the markup icon, and then tap the plus icon next to your toolbar here in the bottom right corner. And you'll see that you can add some pretty cool stuff like stickers and text and shapes and all of that. But if you tap on shapes, you can actually add text inside of that shape by simply double tapping like you see here. Visual lookup is super helpful for identifying things that you take pictures of, maybe like animals or plants, but you can also scan your laundry tags on your clothes so that you can find out what all of those symbols mean, or even identify a phantom car symbol that just randomly shows up while you're driving. If you lose your Apple Watch, you can ping it with your iPhone, just like you would ping your phone on your watch. Go to Settings, Control Center, and then add the Ping Apple Watch option. Then swipe down for Control Center here in the top right and tap on that icon to ping your Apple Watch. If you're in a focus mode and you want notifications to not be silenced while you're actually using the phone, just while the phone is locked, then head into your focus mode and under notifications, tap on options and change the silence notification option from always to only while the phone is locked. Speaking of locking things, the new journal app is a great way to jot down some of your thoughts and reflections, but a lot of that could be personal. And if you don't want people to see it, you can just lock your journal by going into the settings app and then turning on locking the journal option. And this will use Face ID the next time you open your app. Speaking of the journal app, you can actually set a schedule on when you want the app to notify you to get your thoughts written down. Just head into the settings app and under journal, you'll see the schedule option. You can set the time and day that these notifications happen. Did you know you can change the way the whole haptic touch feels and like how fast it actually jumps into whatever you're haptic touching? You can do this by going into settings, accessibility, touch, and then under haptic touch, you can now change from the default option to fast if you want to speed it up, or if you want maybe things to get a little bit slower, you can slow it down as well. I personally really enjoy the fast option. Finally, if you're rearranging your home screen and accidentally misplace some of your apps or a widget and put it in the wrong spot, just simply shake your phone to undo and everything will go back to the way it was. Now, before we end today's video, I do want to give you more information about today's sponsor, Keeper. We're online for everything these days. I think everyone is for the most part. And I shouldn't have to tell you just how important it is to protect your accounts from cyber attacks. Just the other day, my wife experienced the same malicious activity that I've gone through in the past with one of her accounts. And so I had her change her password right away. And for her, who's not you know tech savvy like I am, it's pretty painless that she was able to do it with the help of Keeper. Keeper is the most secure, certified, tested and audited password security platform in the world. I can rest easy knowing that my accounts are protected with full zero trust and zero knowledge security. So if you don't have a password manager yet, what are you waiting for? Don't wait until after a cyber attack leaks your personal information and data to secure your accounts. Take action today and keep your information off of that dark web. And if you wanna get started and save some money, get 50% off with code MACRUMORS50 or give it a test run with a free 30 day trial. Again, you'll find the link in the description down below. And thank you so much to Keeper for sponsoring this video. This has been Dan with MacRumors. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you around in the next video.